Well, Brent and Sarah, earlier this afternoon, the Connecticut State Police Union president informed the top two ranking officials of the Connecticut State Police that the union held a vote of no confidence, calling for the resignation of Commissioner James Ravella and Colonel Stavros Malikas. This all comes in the wake of an audit by the Connecticut Racial Profiling Prohibition Project released earlier this summer that concluded that over the last decade, it was highly likely that troopers may have falsified more than 25,000 traffic tickets, which make it appear that more white drivers were being pulled over than other ethnicities. Now, earlier this afternoon, Fox 61 obtained a letter from the union calling for the resignations of Commissioner Rovella and Colonel Malikas, saying that the two have fostered an environment of mistrust and that they have failed to protect troopers. At part of that letter reads, quote, we no longer have any confidence in you or Colonel Malikas, who stood by idly as you allowed others to publicly make false allegations, destroy the morale of our troopers, and dismantle the reputation of the state police, end quote. The letter goes on to say that the union believes that Rovella and Malikas have lost all credibility and calls for them to resign before things get worse. Now, Governor Ned Lamont has urged people to wait until the results of this traffic tickets investigation before drawing their conclusion. Now, that investigation has now been carried out by the U.S. Department of Justice. So this is the second no confidence vote for Commissioner Rovella. Last month, the state police lieutenants and captains union also voted no confidence. We reached out to Connecticut State Police for comment, but they declined to comment. In the studio, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.